All right, so here's the deal. There's an art show at my gallery slash shop called Statics tomorrow, and it's a custom painted spray can show, but I've been super procrastinating. The show opens tomorrow, and I haven't done any spray cans yet. <laughs> I used to be so professional. Before my YouTube channel like, got a little bit of popularity, I was always like, hit all my deadlines, super on time, like the most professional artist, and now it just feels like I'm behind on everything all the time. But yesterday, I spray painted some base on these spray cans and the art show is all about custom spray cans we partnered up with paps blue ribbon on this one it's a pretty cool show 50 percent of all the sales of all the art is going to seattle art programs there's 10 other artists in the show they're all like my super dope art homies we're all custom painting spray cans they've probably all already done theirs i unfortunately have not also i gotta set up the show today i gotta hang the show print out all the price tags get the gallery all prepped and then have these cans done by tomorrow when this show opens at 5 p.m. So I'm a little bit behind the ball. I'm going to try and start painting a little bit on these right now and then run off to my gallery and start setting up the show as well. So procrastination. Don't do it <laughs> unless you're me. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. Uh, I guess let's just dive into this because I got like no time. So let's see what I can do here. I got a little bit of painting done, but now it's time to head down to my shop statics and set up this art show for tomorrow. <sighs> and then hopefully I can get back here and paint some more. <laughs> but yeah, let's go. All right, just made it down to static. Time to start getting set up for this show. Got uh, some shelves to put up for these spray cans to sit on. Gallery is pretty much empty right now. But yeah, I got some helpers coming through to help me out too. So let's transform this gallery into a custom spray can showcase. <laughs> So this shelf is crazy bowed. Can you guys see how bow how bowed this is? So I think I need to go get another one. Shelves that are being unpacked right now. Kelly, Matt Mitchley, yay yay. Yay yay. Throw these That's last, really good. last cans on there. It's custom joints by the Double M. Here, I'm helping. Hole filler, and I'll fill those. And we can paint over them. Yeah. Finishing touches. Patching some holes. Cans on the wall. Oh, we gotta throw up those last two shelves for Casey's stuff. Yep. So the show is hung, and now I gotta rush back home and finish painting my cans. Be ready for tomorrow for the official opening. Woo! So these cans are for a spray can art show at Statics. And the reason why I had this art show in the first place is when Paps hit me up and said, hey, let's do a special show together. I thought back to that video I did where I made like 93 spray cans in four days. And I was like, hey, maybe all the other artists should do this too. It'd be cool to see how a bunch of other artists interpret making spray cans. It's kind of a hard shape to work on. It's a curved surface and curved surfaces are sort of notoriously difficult for getting the line work and the details that you want. But I'm just having fun with these and I'm super excited about all the other cans that the other artists made. 
I think it'll be a fun show. A lot of the shows that we have at Statics kind of have like fun little themes and fun little gimmicks and like ways to kind of catch people. And maybe being a YouTuber like showed me that you got to have a little bit of a, a little bit of a hook to get people's attention. So we do a lot of these kind of crazy shows at Statics. On these cans, I'm using golden fluid acrylics. I'm using a little bit of the Fabric Castell India ink markers. The spray paint base is like Belton, Molotov. I'm just going for it. I didn't really didn't have any ideas of what I was gonna paint on these cans before I started. I really, really procrastinated this one, but I kind of wanted to paint them, make them a little bit more painterly than the cans I did previously. Last time, it was kind of a spray paint and just some some ink on there, basically like drawing on the cans. These ones I actually wanted to paint on them, and I just put on my audiobook and just you know stayed up real real late and tried to finish them. We do a new art show every single month and this show is like our November show and every single show that we do at Statics opens on the first Thursday of each month. Next month we're doing like a screen print show. Those are always super fun and I don't know. We just, we have a lot of fun. Like our big art show events are really cool because it brings more eyes to more artists. It gives us an opportunity to have a big party each month and it also brings more people into my shop because it's like the Pioneer Square Art Walk which is like the biggest art walk in the city. It's sort of the arts district, the gallery district that my shop is and all the other galleries around also have their opening nights on first Thursday so people can walk from gallery to gallery to gallery a lot of the galleries have like free wine and beer and it's just like cool chill art vibes and you can see a lot of really dope stuff from a lot of really talented Seattle artists and other artists from all around the world so I'm really honored to be a part of the Seattle art community and be able to have these events on the first Thursday of each month all right, it's the day of the show. Let's head down to Statics and get rolling. Hopefully some people show up. Hopefully we sell some cans. Hopefully we help charity. And yeah, I'm excited. Stayed up pretty late finishing these bad boys right here. But I'm ready to go. So here we go. <laughs> All right, so the show is about to begin. We got everything prepped. I've actually already sold like four of my cans, which is super awesome. Yeah, look at those red dots, that's cool. And we've actually sold, we've sold like 11 cans so far from the Statics website, but the show hasn't even begun. That's always good news. I think these cans are really fun, they're really affordable, and these types of shows are the type of shows that we like to do here. Affordable art, fun concepts, so let's get this thing going. I'm excited. Two kings, the show's about to start. How you feeling, bro? Look at these, bro. Got some headphones from Paps. Bro, why are these so official? Holding them down. I might have to wear them tonight. DJ Blue Ribbon, one night only. Dang, bro. <laughs> DJ Blue Ribbon, 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 Ribbon. <laughs> Great. Now we have the PBR headphones unboxing live on our technology channel. I wonder how they hit, man. I wonder if the decibels are right. <laughs> man, they really did a good job sealing these. Your unboxing channel is whack, bro. Yeah, man. Hey, I'll be right back. You gotta be prepared. We're gonna yeah, have to yeah. heavily edit this. Yeah. When did this say you had the help? <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. Struggle is real. Big reveal. Is there another sticker on the other side? This one resealed itself. Oh. There we go. There we go. These look like the wrists, bro. Yeah, wow, schmancy, so schmancy. Ooh, Ooh it smells new. Ooh. It smells new. Were these the headphones you were using? Yeah, look how those ones are hardened. Those are not DJ headphones. No, man. these ones, these are DJ. Oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> 52 kings with the bling. You remember the first time when the headphones were like foaming off yeah. on the sides? <laughs> Looks great with the beret. Ooh, he's like, I gotta go look at myself in the mirror. <laughs> you ready, Kelly? Ready, bro. The beard is combed. No, it's not. Dude. The beer's on ice. <laughs> we got Paps notebooks, Paps tablecloths, <laughs> backpack, hats, shirts, limited edition bottles of Paps whiskey. Paps koozies, baby. 52 Kings got the Paps headphones. Paps it out tonight. Really cool. Thanks, Paps, for collaborating on this show. It's gonna be super rad. On. Who's gonna win? The name says Sue. Me. Sue. That's Yay. your name. That's Yay. Winner. Yay. <laughs>
A really cool thing about statics and having my own place is like it's half my shop, all my art merchandise, all my t-shirts, and then the other half of it is a gallery that rotates every month. Statics has been open for two years now. We've had 24 different art shows. We've had so many artists show in the gallery. We kind of have this reputation for being like a more affordable, more accessible, younger, more like street influenced gallery. And statics represents like our culture, like a little bit of the younger, more like street art graffiti influenced culture. <laughs> Out your work. She's never been in here before. Oh, nice. I love the little spray can holding the spray can. Isn't that awesome? Yeah. Yeah. I'm tempted. I know. These are selling fast. You got to strike while the iron's hot. So far, so good. It's popping in here tonight. Sold a bunch of cans. The online orders are coming in. It's going yeah. good. So this is your boy Ryan from Paps. He partnered up with me on this show. Thank you, bro. What do you yeah. think of the show so far? It's amazing. We have had a constant flow of awesome people rolling through. Everybody seems super hyped. Almost every can is sold, <laughs> so that's a good sign. Raised a bunch of money uh, for charity. Yeah, raised a bunch of money for Urban Artwork. So I think overall, we could call this a success. Woo. Thank you, Ryan. Thank yes. you, Paps. Thank yeah, you. What's yeah. up, Leo? insurance won't cover that bro. Uh, uh, on the sidewalk out front. Okay, okay. With the skateboard, you get the matching socks. Ooh. Whatever's left there is up to you. I didn't see it disappear. <laughs> yeah, come is it gonna be a free for all? Fight! No fights. No fights. We're better yeah. than My insurance won't cover that either. You wanna pick? If you pick your own name, you're voided. Oh, I don't want, I don't want, but I'm in there. He really wants to pay. <laughs> He's got one palmed in his hands. It's me. Anticipation. Takes forever. It's hard to leave, bro. Good thing we got the music. Pearson Peterson. <laughs> She's not here. Who hasn't Pearson Peterson. Hey, let's give her a countdown. Five, four, three, two. What? You win this thing? We had it last year. We're back with who's next? Who's what if that's team? Kirsten right there? Oh, 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 it's it's classic Kirsten. Bobbin! Classic. Who's Bobbin? Bobbin. <laughs> Bobbin. Five, four, three, two, one. Sorry, Bobbin. Can we get more air horns? Sarah Harper. Oh, This is your lucky name. Hey, honestly, thank you all for showing up. One for the road. For participating. This has been an awesome night. We appreciate you coming here. Let's drink some beers. Have a little more fun. All right, it's the end of the night. We sold more than half of the cans, I think. We sold a ton of cans. Mine are all sold out. Feeling really good about that. Skylar's are sold out. Egos are sold out. Selling a lot of cans. Doing awesome stuff for charity. Ooh, it's been a long night. It's 10 o'clock. Um, I'm gonna go home. Rest, relax. Pulled an all-nighter making these cans last night. But yeah, it's been an awesome, awesome, awesome show. It was popping in here tonight. I wish I could have filmed more, but I was like behind the register ringing up the whole night. But this is a fun, fun art show. So yeah, catch you later.